Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my channel if you're new. My name is Emily Grace. Hello, how are you? I'm going to make this quick because my phone's dying and that's my camera. So, for my birthday this year, which is in a few days, April 10th, I got a gift card from my friend Cassidy, Chronically Cassidy here on YouTube, to Amazon. And she said, use it on whatever you want. So... I, of course, immediately, oops, I, of course, immediately thought of my dog and what my dog would want. And so I went through my registry and I picked out a couple of things. So here's the first thing. It's the, it's Nyla Bone Puppy Teething Chew. And, okay, I know you're thinking, like, Hey, you're not getting a puppy, you're getting like a six month old or something. Well, number one, these have very like little chew things they can chew. Number two, I also thought this could be like a good resemblance of keys for like item retrieval. Because they're like, like, you know, or, you know, this is this has a different groove than this one. And this one has a circle and this one, you know what I mean? Because it's very important for dogs to get different um, textures in their mouth. And then I got, so I'm gonna just take the wrappers off because we're gonna start going as soon as the dog comes. So I don't need the wrappers anymore. And then I got, This um, Kong ball, which it says extreme bounce. It's like a big black ball that we can use outside to play fetch and item retrieval. That was from the Kong company. And this next item is from the brand Planet Dog Ball, and it is a huge, huge, I think this ball is going to be like, kind of play soccer with, because unless the dog is this huge dog, I don't know how they're going to get it in their mouth. Um... But this is a huge, huge Planet Dog Ball ball. And there's that. And then this thing is a antler. It is a deer large split antler and it is made in the USA and I just got this because my friend's dog came from a program and they eat a lot of antlers and I figured this is healthier than a dog bone and then this is also from Planet Dog Ball Planet Dog Ball Foundation. Um, and this is just similar to the ball that I got. Those like chuck it balls from Chewy. This is very similar to that. And then the second to last thing I got it, which, this is not what I thought it was going to be. It's like one of those toys that has a water bottle in it. This is from the brand Crinkles. Which, okay, it is not a squeak toy. 
it's not a squeak toy because my Selby has squeak toys and I'm looking at him right now and he's not even reacting. I picked this up, or I had this on the list because this would be good for like, like this is the perfect size of a water bottle. So if I put this in the fridge with a tug rope on it and I say, go get the water, I'm thirsty. And you know, but like, my dog is not even reacting to this. But if it gets to be too much, I can easily cut it and slide the ball bottle out. The last thing I got in this box, cause there was one thing that I got with the gift card that was shipping Monday, is this Kong treat pouch or not no this kong tire and it says that you can stuff treats in here but i'm just going to give it as a regular chew toy it's like a tire it's like a donut it's like a black donut and it says kong on it that is everything i got on my amazon haul hi everyone sorry i'm just getting around to do this but i was just waiting for some stuff to come in this is the last thing I got with uh, the gift card that Chronically Cassidy sent me. Um, it's from Kong, and it's the Kong Jumbler Dogs Need to Play. It's like a boredom buster kind of thing. There's a ball in here that they can just roll and tumble around. But I also thought that, again, this could be a good item retrieval practice because... Basically, everything I've read about item retrieval training is it's just like a big game of fetch, but then you, like, shape the behavior to what you want them to fetch. It could be this water bottle. It could be anything. But I, it, it does squeak. There's a squeaker right here, so if you want to get this for your dog, but you don't want them to have a squeaker, I wouldn't recommend this. I have to break it now. I have to take a knife to it. Although... I mean, you really have to squeeze it hard to get it to squeak, but I don't... But, like, you know, maybe this would be one of the toys that we take to my grandma's house or to the doctor's office to play with, so I don't need it to be squeaking through the entire waiting room. Anyway, I really like this. I've been playing with it a ton, just because I like the... Like that, so... That was the last thing I got from her. And then... Just one more dog supply I got. If this is this, like, couple inch paracord leash, and then it's got a clip. And, hold on. Change. And the use of this leash is to, because it's supposed to go on your wrist, but, like, she made it a little too small for me, so. And this is from the YouTuber um, Pause and Love, and I don't know the name of her shop, but um, I've tagged them on Instagram before, so. Oh, sweet. Okay, yeah, this this fits perfectly on here, you see. It's got enough wiggle room. But, and, and, dog hooks on. And it's got enough slack so it's not choking him or choking me at the same time. But, and then you just unclip, comes off. What I'll probably end up doing, though, is because I'm afraid that the dog is going to not be accustomed to the chair for a little bit, which is understandable because you go from a little two-by-two two kennel to uh, being a working dog in training. And, um, you know, I don't know. 
We'll just have to see. So, maybe what I'll do, because I have a few paracord leashes, and I just have a few. This is like my second red leash, and then I also have one that's about a foot long, or like a little tiny one. Like, I would consider these more to be traffic leashes, I guess. I don't know. Um, but I'm kind of nesting for when the dog comes home, you know. I'm kind of just really, really ready to put all this into good use and see see which toys he likes and see which toys they don't like or he or she, you know what I mean? And I'm just, I'm just ready. I'm really ready. And if you guys want to purchase me something off of my registry, I'm going to leave a link down below. You don't have to, but I know a lot of you love Amazon Smile, so if you donate something to me, why don't you donate something to your cause, too? It's a win, 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 win. So, anyways, I'm just really, really ready to start this adventure. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.